First, click on this icon that says device manager on top right. Here you will see a list of devices. If you don't have any device, you will see this create virtual device. Click on it or you can create a new virtual device by just clicking on this plus button here. Now you can choose the hardware. Do you want a small phone, medium phone, or you can actually choose the pixel devices here itself. Okay, you can see the screen sizes here and the resolution here. So let's choose Pixel 7 Pro here. That is the most commonly available screen size and the resolution these days. And now just click on next. Here you get to choose multiple API versions. So do you want to choose Android Nougat, Oreo, Pi, Q, R, S, and so on. So we'll choose an older one so that we want our app to be tested in an older version so let's say we want to test on oreo so just click this download button next to oreo here click on accept and just click next and this download will start let's wait a few minutes till this image is downloaded and then we can proceed here you can see the progress once the required image is finished downloading just click on finish and now you have the option to either choose oreo or whichever one other you have available for you so i'll just click on the required release and just click next now you can give any name to your virtual device i'll just leave it as it is now when it starts up you can start it up as landscape or portrait mode but it does not matter you can change this later on after the device has started and now just click on finish so now your device has been configured to run it just click on this play button next to it and here you will see starting AVD and you'll see this message connecting to emulator and your AVD will be ready. Once this has been opened, you will be able to see it here in available devices and you can run your apps directly in this device that is selected here. So now you can just install apps in it, run it as you would any normal device and you can see debug logs and so on. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.